Uh, hello YouTube, this is Linen here, and it's been a while. Um, I'll get into why it's been a while later, but first I've got someone with me uh, to do this commentary with, so why don't you do yourself? Hey guys, it's your biggest fan here, Denim51. I'm a reoccurring guest on this channel, thanks for having me. Mm -hmm. That's fun. <laughs> right, so, um, so I'm just, I've got a bit of a flu still. <laughs> yeah, anyway, it's okay. Um, yeah. Uh, so, as you can see, I've got some Sniper Elite 3 gameplay. Um, this is the Hunt the Grey Wolf DLC, I believe it's called. You're yeah. the reason they call it Elite, because <laughs> of your skills right here. Uh, uh, yeah, it's it's, um, it's quite a decent game. This is actually on my new gaming PC. Um, it's all running at 1080p with full setting. It, it um, doesn't really test it very much, but it's it's still quite a good looking game, I think. Um, speak, so, speak, speaking of um, quality, uh, is it in 60 frames per second as well? Did you record in that? or um, No, I, I noticed that. Did you hear about that recently? Uh, YouTube. Yeah, oh, YouTube. They're, they're bringing, bringing back. back. Yes. I know, yeah. it's really exciting. No, this is locked to 30 right now, but yeah, once they start doing that, I'll definitely uh, start up in the FPS because obviously it looks a lot better with machines that can handle it. Yeah. So, um, other than that, other than that, do you want to tell people like where you've been and or where we've both been, kind of, and what? Oh yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. Um, uh, basically, I've been I've explained it in previous videos like six months ago. <laughs> but, so <laughs> I've I've been at university, and um, basically, I just had too much work to do to find time to make uh, consistent videos. Um, oh yeah, work right. Yeah. Well that, yeah. I did, I said I was going to get my gaming PC in about February, but it turned out it, didn't, it was until about Mayish time. So it took me a while to do that. Um, but yeah, in general, do you want to uh, tell what are your uh, PC specs real quick? Uh, right, so I'm currently using a fourth generation i7 uh, quad core processor. Um, I believe the graphics card is a Radeon ATI. Um, HD, what's it called? Two uh, ACX, which is one of the highest models. You get some really good performance on it, as you can see. Mm. Quite nice. And I did say I've got a, a PlayStation Four. I was playing uh, Battlefield Four on the PlayStation Four quite a lot, and I uploaded some videos of that. Um, but I traded that in and got it for Skype. And uh, I must apologise here; the, the game is slightly buggy. In a minute, because I think it's because Fraps doesn't, it's not fully compatible with this game or something, so it just freezes a little bit every now and then. That's the problem with PC games, like, everyone uh, everyone has their individual issues with PC, like, yeah. if the game's compatible, because everyone's like building it and there's so many parts to it, and mm -hmm. well, I've had, uh, I haven't had many problems with this, to be honest. It's, everything's running quite smoothly so far. Except Fraps. Yeah. But uh, there's things like, um, I've got Watch Dogs recently and uh, there's been some problems with that on PC they've been apparently they scaled back the game from like an earlier E3 where it looks mm. much better and someone found the settings hidden away somewhere <laughs> which was pretty bad <laughs> but um, yeah anyway enough about the PC basically uh, I traded in Battlefield 4 on, PC, on PS4 and I've got it for PC now so when I play Battlefield 4 if I come across anything decent I'll, um, I'll record it and I will add it to the gameplay series that I started a few months ago, which is where I basically just give like tips out about Battlefield. That's you just give the it. tip. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Just a tip. Uh, not just one tip, but just like if it's a really good gameplay that shows, you know, how to play a certain way, then I'll upload it and tell them about it. <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. So, what about you? How's your channel been going? My channel, oh, it's been going quite well. Uh, Woody's Gamer Tag, if you guys don't know, he's a guy with over a million subscribers. He basically uploaded one of my videos, uh, obviously with my permission, and it was a song that I made, and it was it's it's, it's huge. It's got so many views, so many comments, and I've yet to make another video um, after that because after you make a great video such as my, you know, such as my video, you've um the you've got to make another video, like, following up. You've got to make another great video following up that one. And uh, I've been uploading a couple of videos here and here and there, but I'm just trying to find the medium to um, to, to the perfect video to upload, if you know what I mean. I, I'm in the process of making a channel 
uh, a trailer, and that's going pretty well. Right. We'll upload that at some point. Mm-hmm. The, the gameplay just skipped forward there because uh, there's quite a few bits where in this uh, commentary where I'd skip out because it's quite long. There's stuff like I guess that's what she said. Times. <laughs> I get caught a couple times where I'm just waiting somewhere for like five minutes for someone to move or something. Waiting. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, people do that in Call of Duty as well. <laughs> oh, yeah, in like corners. This is like this is almost like a Call of Duty. It reminded me of um no not Call of Duty yeah of course not. This reminded me of uh, Metal Gear Solid Five. It's uh, the gameplay is very similar apart from a couple of things where it's not quite as good. But this is a this is a budget game. It's it's run by a company that doesn't really have like a massive budget. So it does look quite impressive to be honest. It is it's, it's fun to play as well from what I've played so far. I Kill him, Alex. Recommend. <laughs> no, he's uh, I think I just wait for him to turn around again and just take him out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. I do enjoy this game. If I'd recommend anyone to buy it, to be honest. So uh, really, with your YouTube career, what do you think is going to be the future? Career? Um, no, no, no. For, yeah, for you. What, what it's not really a career. Do? I don't, I don't know. Um, yeah, I'll like because I said last time. I said I'll, I'll be uploading regularly. You know, don't worry about it. Yeah. <laughs> It's you really stuck to that one, didn't you? Yeah, I know, but um, well, what what I can say is that I'm home for three months from college or university, so it's not like like I'll be making videos every now and then, um, and I'll see how it goes. If I get enough people watching, then I will keep them going as when I go back. So it's, it'll be little projects from now until then, I reckon. Hmm. Mini projects. Yeah. Any any sort of series ideas in the work? Um, not particularly. Vlogs? Be, be, no, nah, no vlogs. <laughs> There'll be some uh, Battlefield 4, maybe some other stuff. I'll see, I'll see what I've got. I've got Titanfall as well, so I might do some of that. That's quite a good game. I tried to do a vlog the other day. I was on a bike, uh, a couple of weeks ago in fact. I tried to do a vlog. Um, I was on a bike and I was pedalling at the same time. And I was like, <gasps> hey guys. <laughs> um, it didn't It didn't work out well because uh, it was like a windy day. So Yeah. Okay, in case you were thinking... Great. Yeah, in case you were thinking of doing a um, a vlog on a bike, don't do that. <laughs> we're just about halfway through this cut on here. That's fine. Uh, yeah, we've got a little bit while to go. So, in general, like I've, I, I sort of took a break from YouTube. I didn't go on it for like three months. <laughs> but um, yeah, I noticed some changes when I came back. First one I mentioned it to you yesterday is that PewDiePie has just... I mean, he's got like 20 million subscribers since I last left. Yeah, yeah. I don't understand him at all. I don't see the appeal. No, um, I think it's so yeah, so to, but... to like kind of avoid like sort of the wrong thing being said, what I feel is PewDiePie doesn't make content that appeals to a certain amount of people. It does. He makes content which doesn't appeal to certain people, and obviously that those type of people may be, you know. Yeah, a couple uh, of us. So, like, it's, yeah, it's dark. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. The old like game inside of YouTube is almost dead. To be honest, I mean that, that's just a signal of it. Mm. But, like, he's the most popular gaming channel now by a mile, by like a hundred times anyone else. <laughs> and then you've <laughs> got other people who are pretty much retired, like uh, you know, Blame Truth. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's uh, hung up his controller now, so you could say. <laughs> <laughs> but. Uh, yeah, he used to play, um, he was the original, like, Call of Duty commentator. Mm. And, uh, I think he's given it up now, because his, cha- apparently his channel is, uh, really buggy, like... Pokemon? He does a lot of Pokemon, yeah, but his channel is really buggy, because, like, the subscribers, um, like, they, they don't see half his content for some reason or something like that. Oh, yeah, YouTube's always having that, that issue, though, that's the thing, like, um, they, they brought out Twitch as well for their live stream, so... Yeah, but he stopped playing, like, Call of Duty and stuff like that. That's pretty much dead as well, I think. Mm. Uh, I traded in... I haven't mentioned that on here. I traded in Call of Duty Ghosts. I mentioned how much I hated it on our last one, the these we did. But, uh... Yeah, I was quite happy to see the back of that. <laughs> Ghosts is such a weird game. Like, I didn't play it, and I was, like, really confused when I was watching t play it. Like, are you... Do you play as the bad guy, or, like... No, I, 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 <laughs> campaign... Yeah, like, the campaign after that after I was like, you know, I didn't understand like, these these ghost people. They're like, you hear about them at the start and you're like, oh, okay, and then 
five minutes later, your, your dad takes off a mask. Spoilers here, by the way. <laughs> your dad takes <laughs> off a mask, and then he goes, oh, you're a ghost now. And I'm like, okay, this is a really shit story. <laughs> yeah, like, I didn't really fully understand it. It wasn't. It didn't really grab my attention or anything like that. It was a good effort, and I, I mean, there's like satellites falling from the sky, Odin. Oh, although I did... Motion bullets here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like special skills. <laughs> okay, but I did like... Cool. I did like the um, like the space mission, and why is it always why is it always with Call of Duty with the really cool missions are like two minutes long, and then like it's the same thing kind of over and over again if you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. Like the, yeah, the, okay. there was like, wasn't there a fight in space on Ghost, and I was like, whoa, the dynamic that they did, you know, they kind yeah, of tweaked the. Bit, I'm not gonna lie, I, um, I thought that bit was really really awesome. And I, it was that like, like five minutes in as well. Yeah, and they tweak the engine and like the bullets, they they fire differently and you move differently and everything. Well, admit, though, um, Advanced Warfare, it looks quite impressive as a game, but I think it's probably going to suffer from the same problems as usual. Oh god. Mm. But uh, apparently it's uh, Sledgehammer Games, and they had a three-year cycle with it, so um, I don't know, maybe, who knows? Might be a good game. I don't know what Call of Duty can really do to kind of save that, you know, to get back that Call of Duty 4 feeling. I don't know what they can do anymore. No, no, I just I just play Call of Duty 4 on PC now. <laughs> yeah. Apparently there are still people playing that. Yeah, it's, it's quite popular still. It's one of the reasons I got a game on PC, to be honest. <laughs> but, um, my, my 360's packed in now. It started destroying my discs, it destroyed my GTA 5. So I'll be getting that on PC. I can play again. Yay. Or PlayStation, because, you know. Switching out a little bit there, you just stood up whilst it was prone. A PlayStation would never eat your disc, like an Xbox. No, yeah, they're definitely built a little bit better. Remember the, uh, when the Xbox One came out, it made that, when you put a disc in, it made that drill, drilling noise on some of them. That's that. Kind of <laughs> yeah. But, um, yeah, so what do you think of E3? I forgot to mention that. Ooh, E3, that was a couple of weeks ago now. Mm. Um, I thought it was I thought, boring, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, I, I liked last year's one where... Um, I, I I don't find E3 that exciting anymore. I don't know why, but like the last year's one was probably the best that I've ever seen. Where like, Sony took like little shots at Microsoft, and Microsoft were kind of yeah, with that, digging uh, themselves a hole. The advert with, where he just says, this is how you trade a game on PlayStation 4. Yeah, he just hands him the game. game. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was quite clever. Yeah, I like I like their marketing. I like the way that they did that, and they showed exciting stuff. You know, Destiny, Watch Dogs, um, mm-hmm. which is only now just coming out. <laughs> um, yeah, it's a uh, this gun's really glitch. It's like it's like DLC weapons, but they're not compatible with the DLC. So it's supposed, it's supposed to be a shotgun, but it's it's like an MP40, but it's not. It's like glitchy. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bit strange. But you're yeah, playing. Yeah. You're not playing online, are you? No, this is a campaign mission. Alright, it doesn't matter if your weapon's OP, you know? Yeah, it took a good bit a minute. I'll, uh, I'll put the name of it in the uh, title, but you, I haven't told you yet, ever. No. <laughs> yeah, this is the uh, Hunt the Grey Wolf DLC. I suppose you haven't heard of that. I haven't. Alright, then you'll, you'll like who the sniper target is. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's, it's set during World War II, this game, which is quite cool. And uh, I don't know if the world's... I think I've like played so many World War Two games. I don't know if I'm ready for any more. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? It's like, different in its own way. I like it. Where you play as like the Nazi and you're meant to lose, or <laughs> no, you play as a uh, American sniper taking out uh, Axis targets or German targets. Oh, it's quite cool. But, um, how many how many minutes left have we got? Because um, we can quickly talk about uh, King Jong Un. Uh, we can quickly talk about Kim Jong Un and f- saying it's like a it's an outrage what from the, the yeah the movie that Seth Rogen yeah, decided yeah. to make <laughs> about assassinating him. Mm. What do you think about that? Uh, I just blown out of proportion. It's just I don't know. I, I suppose I'd be quite angry if someone made one about uh, Barack Obama. But he's a I don't know. He's an idiot. <laughs> the whole country's deluded, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> no, 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 yeah, you're right, you're right, like... Anyway, um, yeah, he's a sniper target. And you can see him there. Can you make out who it is? I can't make out who it is. Who is it? Never see the slow motion bullet in a sec. 
Uh, oh. Hitler! Oh, <laughs> my God. <laughs> yeah. yeah he Hitler assassinated. A target. That's a $10 DLC, that is, just to kill Hitler. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, that's quite expensive. I like uh, that, I like that. Hmm. I think I, I should have patched this game, because the uh, DLC's not working properly, obviously. But, um, anyway, that's the end of it. I forgot to mention what I saw about E3, didn't I? Did I <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah well, in general, I thought... Uh, well, no one pays attention to Nintendo anymore, but they did quite well, I think. Uh, basically, the other two were just talking a load of rubbish. But uh, that's the end of the video. <laughs> okay. So, um, maybe we'll do another one of these soon. Yeah. So, I have to leave it there. Basically, the, the crux of the video was uh, that I have been away now, and I got a gaming PC, and then... I It's making a back. comeback. Oh, yes, I suppose so. I'll be uploading some more Battlefield and continuing the series, hopefully. And I'll have you back on as a, a guest quite soon. That you will. That you will. Cool. Alright, I'll talk to you later then. Bye. Bye, guys. See you later. <laughs> Bye.